Hi everyone, my name is Ellen and this is your Tarot reading for Capricorns for April. Um, I hope you guys are doing great. And first of all, I would like to let you know that uh, I have a website now. It's called Esoterica Fox. Um, I will be leaving this in the description underneath this video. You are welcome to have a look and leave any requests for personal tarot readings or advices. And let's start. Let's see what universe prepare for you guys. I wish you all the best. First card is uh, Nine of Cups. Nine of Cups. Card of wishes coming through. A uh, card of personal set satisfaction, happiness, uh, you are happy with your achievements, you are uh, proud of your achievements because you've done them all uh, all by yourself, you build you build this, what you have and you're enjoying what you have, all with your own hands, um, all by yourself. Card of balance, like I said, card of some, uh, you have things to be proud of. Um, and you just enjoying and admiring yourself and your hard work which is paid off for you. Uh, the only thing I would suggest here, advice, uh, don't isolate yourself from the people, from the society. Don't close up and just stay with your achievements. Open up a little bit to, to people. Uh, also, don't over celebrate your achievements with uh, consuming the alcohol. Uh, you know, we have cups, many cups, so everything is good in moderation. So, let's see the card come out. Let's see what that is. And we have eight of swords. Look from 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 this to this. <laughs> very uh, very different. Um, moods here but like i said don't don't close yourself up mm, don't close yourself from society and here if you hear you haven't yet but here yes you have uh, you decided to isolate yourself from everyone and here you are full of uh, fears uh, and undecided um don't feel um, freedom of movement. You don't. You don't want to face uh, face the reality. You don't want to face what's around you. You don't want to deal with it. You rather like hide and don't do nothing and hoping that it will resolve itself or that will go away. But you know that's not the case. Uh, so the longer you will stay like this because here you put your you put those swords around you so nobody can come to you and you cannot uh, come out you put your um, tied your eyes and tied yourself up nobody else and only you can undo all of this so you can only you can untie your eyes and open up to people and face with what you need to face with and sooner you do that, uh, sooner that will be resolved, first of all. Second of all, the longer you stay here like this, the, in deeper depression you might, might fall. And it's harder going to be to get out. So, um, oh, like I said, you need, to, you need to get out from the situation. If you have some doubts in your head, some uh, doubting thoughts, some dark thoughts. Here you need to uh, get rid of them uh, as soon as possible. Let's see what else. The star, the high rank card star. Look. Yes, you will do it because here. Look how different moods you can see even in the card. Uh, this is your wishes and dreams coming through. Uh, this is card of progress. This is a card saying everything will be 
working out just great. Believe in yourself. Believe in your dream. Uh, everything will will be fine. Uh, also, this is a great card for people in anything to do with art in any shape or form. So you're gonna feel creative. You're gonna feel uh, full of inspiration, full of energy, full of life. So this is very good, guys. Let's see what else. Knight of Cups. Uh, Knight of Cups uh, represents person, most likely. Um, uh, if you're single, maybe it's uh, someone, maybe a new person uh, uh, will be entering into your life or somebody you already know, but you just didn't realize that they have um, any interest in you. So pay attention around and uh, so, this person could um, give you some compliments, small gifts, maybe uh, will ask you on, um, on the first date. Let's see what else. Let's see what else. Uh, five of Wands. Five of Wands, card of conflict, possible conflict um, or disagreement with your colleagues, with your loved ones, with your family um, or a competition. So if you in any competitive sport, um, you will win, but it's not going to be easy. It's going to be quite uh, something you have to work for. Um, or like I said, if it's a conflict it can be quite a heated debate which again you will win but that's not going to be easy um, the best is to avoid this conflict if you can and not enter it because like I said uh, it's going to be quite heated and and difficult to to fight for your opinion or your your truth your your right is not always worth it also you need to pay attention to uh, maybe to your health or it could be if you feeling unwell that in this case here you will overcome the illness you will win over you will be fine or maybe here and um, with this you are wishing for the for the person or the prince on the white horse and here we are the person will will appear but maybe not everybody gonna support uh, support that new new entry in your life let's see what else queen of wands look at this could be person in your life um, could be person uh, your friend could be your boss someone you know and um, could be associated with a lion or Leo or Sagittarius <clears throat> if you know anybody it could be involved in your life and you might so this person might give you advice or mm, support you <clears throat> uh, because this person for example is very good great businessman maybe you can have a business advice or business idea from this kind of person and this could be a uh, yes it's um, queen of wands but it could be man or woman <clears throat> let's see let's see what else And we have six of cups. 
uh, six of cups, I'm calling this card um, trip to down to memory lane uh, because this is card of remembering your past, um, very warm, full of warm feelings, um, remembering maybe remembering your children when they were little, maybe reflecting on your past, on your life, and uh, thinking how how far away, how long ago that was, how how everything's changed. Mm, but this is card is full of um, a little bit of a sentimental nice um, memories. Maybe you want to take some time uh, with the nature for for walk, or just look in your family albums, or you're gonna have a look on your phone on on um, in your photos and remember this. So my feel a little bit uh, sentimental. <coughs> Let's see what else. Page of Cups. A page of Cups, it could be uh, if you have children, so it could be your child, maybe you might hear from, so maybe you're gonna watch uh, for this photo album together, or you just were looking and thinking about. Uh, your child and here you go, here you go the, per the person come to visit you and give you a small uh, small gift or if someone maybe your colleague or somebody might uh, pay you compliments and maybe give you small small nice um, nice gift or ask asking you for for a coffee like this uh, Knight of Cups. So if here maybe person just give you compliments, so here he might he might uh, make a move, might 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 go further and ask you for coffee. Let's see what else. Ten of Cups. Ten of Cups, um, card of happiness, card of joy, full house, um, feeling love, uh, feeling uh, fulfillment, uh, emotional calmness, and like I said, happiness all together. It's a great, uh, great. Everything is good in all aspects uh, in your life, in your home life. In your, in your work life, you feeling stable, secure. Let's see what else. <clears throat> Strength, high rank card. Strength. Strength will say that you can conquer. Conquer anything you you want, anything you like in this life. You overcome. You can overcome any obstacle. So, uh, like I said, avoid the conflict if you can. But well, you will win anyway. But like I said, you are stronger than you think. You are. Mm, your inner strength is in you. It's you have this core in you, and when it's needed, you can you can stand up for yourself. You can. Uh, protect yourself and you can, like I said, overcome anything and conquer anything. So there's no obstacle on your on your way. Let's see what else. <clears throat> Knight of Swords. Uh, Knights of Swords will say that some news might be coming your way <clears throat> or you will decide to go and uh, get extra qualification, uh, extra education. So you decide maybe go to go join some courses, <clears throat> maybe some higher education. Uh, and here you're going to be full, uh, fulfilled with um, lots of information. Um, 
spontaneously, unexpectedly, and or spontaneously you decided to go and study and and learn something. Uh, also, this card will say it might be a situation where you have to act uh, and react fast, quick, and spontaneously. So let's see what else. Two of Pentacles. Two of Pentacles, um, card of balance. Card will say that you will need to um, keep an eye on your finances. You need to keep an eye on your spending, on your incomes and your outcomes. So you have to be in control. So you know what's going on. So balance it everything right. Uh, what can you spend? What uh, can you afford? Um, make your priorities possibly. Mm, also, um, this is not just a finance. This is also a health. Um, and other res resources. So... Here you also need to find the right balance between your home and work life. <clears throat> so you have equal equal rest uh, to stay to stay up in, in shape, to stay up in, in good health and be able to earn money. <clears throat> okay guys, let's see what Angel's gonna suggest. Oh, two cards come for, for you. So, here we go. Two messages from the angels. First one is fresh air. Look at this. <clears throat> Your body needs refreshment from oxygenated air generated by grass, trees, plants and flowers. Spend time outside today as near to Mother Nature's cradle as possible. Open your curtains and windows to refresh your home as well. So this is a great message. Mm, go and spend more time outside, maybe with your loved ones. And next message is what do you desire? And look at this one. You know, uh, you now have to, I uh, know, you now have the opportunity to write the script according to your heart's true desires. Once you clearly decide upon your true desires and know that you are ready and deserving of them, they rush into your life as if, as if by magic. This is um, a great message, guys, especially with this uh, high rank of the, the star. Like I said, dream, decide what you truly need and, and the universe will send it to you. Let's see what nature would want to say to you guys. We'll spend it more time in the nature. Let's see. Maintain your childlike spirit. Yeah. It's okay to be childish sometimes. It, uh, because we still have a inner child in us. Let, let this child out so, time to time. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoy your reading. I wish you all the best. Again, thank you for all your all your comments. I'm reading them. I'm trying to reply to all of them. Uh, this means a lot. Uh, please like, subscribe. Uh, visit my, chan my channel. Visit my website. And I'll see you soon. Bye.